Hi everyone, I am Subhadeep. So in this video, I am going to explain some questions, and these questions were asked in 2024 JE main. And so first question was from uh, a parabola. So is given a parabola. So suppose uh, this is the coordinate axis, and our parabola is y square equals to 12x right so let us draw this parabola so this is our parabola y square equals to 12x and the length of the focal quads uh, so suppose this is our focal focus and this is our focal quad so this is a and this is our b suppose so length of the focal quad this is b a b length of a b so this is our uh, 15 given right now the coordinate of a will be what so coordinate of a will be we know that uh, this is a t square comma 2 a t right so it is t1 square 2 a t so what is a here so y square equals to 4 into 3 into x so our a is here 3 so coordinate of a will be what 3 t square comma 2 a t that means uh, this will be 6 60 right now uh, this is we know that uh, this coordinate will be what so this is t t1 equals to minus 1 we know that formula right so the coordinate of this b will be what so this will be 3 by t square comma minus uh, 6 by t right so this will be the coordinate of uh, b now what we have to find we have to find uh, it is given that a minus b uh, not a minus b so this is in the length of a b is 15 is given so root over of 3 t square minus 3 divided by t square this whole square plus 3 by t square not 3 so this will be uh, 60 plus 1 6 by t this whole square equals to 15 square right so not 15 square this is 15 so this is implies that so 9 into t square minus uh, 1 by t square whole square plus 6 into t plus 1 by t this whole square equals to what uh, 15 square that means 2 to 5 right. so this will be implies that uh, so this is 9 into t plus 1 by t so we can take common uh, 9 t we can take common this uh, 9 into so this will be 36 right so this will be 9 into t plus 1 by t uh, whole square we can talk, take common so this will be t minus 1 by t whole square plus 4 and this is equals to 2 to 5 so implies that this is 9 into so if you look at this this is nothing but t plus 1 by t whole square that means t plus 1 by t to the power 4 total so this is 2 to 5 and this is implies that t plus 1 by t whole to the power 4 and this is with this will be uh, so 25 so this will be t plus 1 by t equals to root 5 right so we get the value of t plus 1 by t now what we have to find we have to find the distance of the focal cord from the origin so for that we need the equation we need the equation of a v right so equation of a v will be what so equation of a v since this a b passing through the focal this coordinate is 3 0 we know that this is a 0 a 0 means 3 0 so equation of a b will be what y minus y 1 that means uh, 0 right so this will be m so m is what m is here this is uh, it is square so we can m is what m is 60 plus 6 by t divided by y 2 minus y 1 divided by 3 t square minus 3 by t square this right so this will be uh, 6 into t plus 1 by t divided by 3 into t square minus 1 by t square into x minus 3 
so this is implies that y equals to so this will be as 2 into x minus 3 divided by t minus 1 by t t minus 1 by t because 1 will be cancelled so t minus so how we get t minus 1 by t so t minus 1 by t whole square equals to t plus 1 by t whole square that means 5 minus 4 into this will be 1 so this will be 1 so t minus 1 by t whole square equals to 1 that means t minus 1 by t equals to plus minus 1 right so uh, this will be y equals to what 2 into x minus 3 and if we take plus 1 so this will be 1 so this will be 2x minus y minus 6 equals to 0 so what will be the distance so from origin so distance from origin p equals to what p equals to so 0 plus 0 plus 6 mod divided by root 5 so now what we have to find at 10 p square so what is 10 p square 10 p square equals to so 10 into 36 by 5 so this is 72 now similarly if we put minus 1 so what we, uh, what we get so this will be if we take minus 1 what will happen 2x minus uh, 2x minus minus 2x plus 6 equals to y so this will be minus 2x plus y plus 6 equals to 0 similarly it will give the distance 72 so not 7 is distance so 10p square will similarly give you 72 so what will be the answer so this c will be the answer for this question so let us uh, jump into the uh, second question so the second question is this from continuity so we have to check uh, if this is continuous then we have to find alpha square plus beta square so we know that uh, when a function is continuous limit x tends to 0 0 minus fx equals to limit x tends to 0 plus fx equals to f of 0 if this satisfies then the function is continuous now let us find uh, limit x tends to 0 plus uh, fx so 0 plus that means we can write it as limit h tends to 0 f of 0 plus uh, h right so this will be equals to limit h tends to 0 f of h means uh, h tends to 0 so this 0 that means this function so that means if we take uh, 0 plus if x greater than 0 that means 0 plus h so now uh, if we take uh, so for this function this will be what so this will be beta into root over of 1 minus cos h divided by uh, x divided by h that means h so this will be limit h tends to 0 beta into we can write it as 2 sine square h by 2 divided by uh, so root over of we can write h square right so this will be uh, beta limit h tends to 0 root over of sine square h by 2 divided by h by 2 whole square and this here to balance this we need root 2 uh, this uh, into root 2 divided by uh, this will be h by 2 that means 4 so this will be beta by root 2 right so these things we get so this is equals to beta by root 2 calculation is right so this is if we take root 2 here so this will be 4 that means 2 yes yes this is right beta by root 2 now so uh, we have to find 0 minus so for 0 minus so limit x tends to 0 minus uh, fx so this means limit x tends h tends to 0 f of 0 minus h right now put uh, f of minus h here for the first function so 1 minus cos alpha so this will be limit h tends to 0 1 minus cos minus alpha h so this will be alpha h divided by uh, h square minus h square so this is h square so this is equals to limit h tends to 0 
टू शाइन स्क्वेयर अल्फा एच बाई टू डिवाइड बाई अल्फा एच बाई टू होल स्क्वेयर सो दिस विल बी अल्फा स्क्वेयर डिवाइडेड बाई अल्फा स्क्वेयर दिस इज सो फोर सो दिस विल बी फोर हेयर सो दिस इज अल्फा स्क्वेयर बाई टू राइट सो अल्फा स्क्वेयर बाई टू इक्वल्स टू बीटा बाई रूट टू इक्वल्स टू वट बीटा बाई रूट टू इक्वल्स टू टू बिकॉज एफ ऑफ जीरो इज गिवेन टू सो वट इज अल्फा सो अल्फा इज अल्फा इज आवर अल्फा स्क्वेयर इज फोर एंड बीटा इज टू रूट टू सो वी हैव टू फाइंड फोर इंटू अल्फा स्क्वेयर प्लस बीटा स्क्वेयर राइट सो फोर इंटू अल्फा स्क्वेयर मीन्स फोर प्लस दिस मीन्स not 4 into so we have to find alpha square plus beta square so this will cancel so 4 into this will be 8 so this is 12 so for this question this second 12 will be the answer now let's jump into the uh, third question so third question was very easy so this question uh, alpha beta is the root of this equation so since alpha beta is the root of this equation so what is the sum of the uh, roots this will be minus b by a and product of the roots will be minus c plus c by a right now we have to find a root uh, find a equation whose roots is 1 by alpha and 1 by beta so you know that uh, the equation whose roots are 1 by alpha and 1 by beta is x square minus sum of these roots 1 by this x plus 1 by alpha into 1 by beta this is equals to 0 now this is implies that x square minus so this will be alpha plus beta divided by alpha beta plus 1 by alpha beta equals to 0 now this is implies that x square into x so x square plus bx by a plus bx so bx by a divided by c by a right and this is uh, 1 by alpha beta that means a by c equals to 0 so this is implies that x square plus so a will be cancelled bx by c plus a by c equals to 0 so this is implies that c x square plus bx plus a equals to 0 c x square plus bx plus a equals to 0 so first option is correct so these are the three questions i explained here and i will explain all these questions and of 2024 je main and 4th, 5th, 6th April, whatever questions they are asked. So, thank you everyone for watching this video. And if you like this video, you can share with your friends. If you have any doubt regarding these questions and answer, you can ask in the comment section below. Bye.